Hello and welcome. In this video, I'm going to give you a brief introduction to the Material Resource Planning module of BEAS Manufacturing. BEAS is equipped with an extended integrated materials management feature, optimized for practical application in production. For this, to plan all materials and check the requirements to produce an item, we offer our comprehensive Material Resource Planning module. You can define different planning scenarios with all necessary requirements based on SAP forecasts for dedicated items or time ranges and select resources to provide graphical view of utilization. MRP works like a calculator. The objective is to plan the inventory flow throughout the period according to inflows and outflows per period. The results of the MRP run are recommendations that fulfill growth requirements by taking into consideration the existing inventory levels and existing purchase orders and production orders. The MRP run also considers defined planning rules for multiple order and minimum order quantity, as well as preferred vendor data. Before the actual calculation, you should make all necessary settings for your own scenario. One of these areas is found in the configuration wizard. You may want to set the average lead time. Here it is set to 2, which means that when I have a sales order with a delivery date, the system takes the delivery date minus these two days, and this is the new end date for the work order. External operations, SAP forecast, can also be set to be considered in MRP. You can pre-select which supplier should be taken in the calculation and many more. In the Item Master Data Planning Data tab, you can start the defining planning method of an item and provide additional pieces of information like lead time, again, or minimum order amount, set accumulation, and define the priority, which makes it possible in the order recommendation to sort or filter items by priority. A note on warehouses, you need to select the warehouses for bill of materials, otherwise MRP will not find them. With the MRP wizard, you can create any number of scenarios. Purchase, planning, sales scenarios that are tailored to the needs of the actual company department. This scenario planner has three different tabs to customize your calculation. In the first, scheduling tab, you can filter materials and processes to narrow down the calculation target, dedicated item ranges, item properties, forecasts, selected work orders on employees, and can set what to display in the order recommendation to follow. In the Detail tab, you can fine-tune all the detailed settings of the MRP scenarios. In the Warehouse tab, you can select the warehouses that you want to be considered in the calculation. The system can also show you per day, per week or month what capacity you need for forecasts, sales orders and production orders, that is work orders. This is MRP2. If you select a resource, you can click on the capacity percentage and it will open another window with the work orders, sales orders or forecasts for this period. With this quick overview, the sales team can make the forecast and the planning team can decide if they can deliver it with the available resources. If any of the resources above 100%, the planning team can give feedback to the sales team that adjustments need to be made. After the calculation for material requirements of the production is completed, you can check all the details in the order recommendation window. The details show you when you need certain items in stock, when you need to create purchase orders to receive the assemblies on time, or create work orders to produce the item, set your view to be broken down in weeks, and you can check from where the demand comes in for each requirement. You can set up security days and create purchase requests, production orders and warehouse transfer requests. By clicking on the button Mode, you can see all requirements in a list and work on item level to plan purchase requests, production requests or inventory transfer requests, and you can perform functions for all lines at once. With window settings, you can select the information you'd like to see in the upper requirement area and drag and drop the field to view the information in the desired place in the order recommendation window. The Material Resource Planning module of BEAS, therefore, helps you plan required quantities for complex manufacturing processes, to define new planning scenarios and to analyze the MRP results. In order that the product is manufactured by the desired time and at the required quantity, 
the MRP wizard creates recommendations for the purchase and production. After this general introduction, our follow-up videos will provide individual MRP calculation scenarios for specific user cases. Thank you very much for your attention.